All right, let's get started. Today, Mikey and I are going to survive inside the train. Yeah, it's a zombie apocalypse out there. So we're taking the last train and riding it into the ruined city. We hope to find survivors there and unite because it's getting harder and harder to survive alone. Anyway, we'd like to show you what we've built because this train has become almost like a home to us. There are lots of rooms and we're going to use them. Exactly. We really took a long time to build all this. Now it's the most secure place we've ever been. I really hope the zombies really can't come to us because if they get in, it will be really dangerous. It won't be dangerous, JJ. We'll be ready for anything. There will definitely be some humans in the ruined city and we can set up our base. I sure hope so because we've been traveling nonstop for days now. This could be really serious because I want to solve this as soon as possible. Anyway, our biggest problem is that we can't solve it all at once. I want to do everything I can to find the base with survivors as soon as possible. Mikey's right. That is the number one goal of this adventure. Friends, as you can see, we have a kitchen, a bath, and of course, the garage. Yeah, it's a very cool monster truck. Too bad we couldn't bring mine here. There's just no room. That's why we only have one. Anyway, we're totally ready to go here already. It's a real bunker. Only we don't have enough food. We'll have to get some when we stop and find some in town. I'm sure there's still some left. We can definitely do that. Yes, we're all ready to go into town now. We have some weapons and armor so we can fight off the zombies just in case. We'll be in the ruined city in no time at all. Hopefully there's someone there. Keep up the morale, JJ. There's 100% someone left in there. It's only a matter of time before we find someone there. Anyone would be really welcome. I want to resolve this as quickly as possible. Yes, friends. We'll wait until we get to our point of arrival. We'll be there. JJ, we must be approaching the city by now. I see the first zombies. There's nothing wrong with that. Just be ready to arrive in the city. Hey, this really isn't funny anymore. Apparently the zombies have set up barricades in our way. JJ, slow down as fast as you can. We're gonna hit her like that. Oh, I didn't slow down in time and we really hit it. That's really bad. Who knew zombies could be so smart? That's just awful. Anyway, we need to do something about it. I mean, we've got to keep driving. What if zombies attacked our train and are already inside somewhere? That could be dangerous. Ouch! JJ, there are zombies sneaking in. Mikey, get out of there as fast as you can. We need to arm ourselves. Yeah, you're right. We have to get out of here and beat them all. I don't want to give them my train. That's why we need weapons and armor. The sooner we get it all together, the better off we'll be. I want to finish this as soon as possible. Each of us can really take this very seriously. I want to go through and destroy the zombies. We have to knock them off our train and then remove the obstacle in the way. You're totally right, Mikey. We have to do it as fast as possible. After all, the longer we're in one place, the more zombies will be around. So we really need to speed up. We have to beat them all. That's a great attitude, JJ. We just have to get the job done. I want to find that safe place at the very end of the earth. We'll find it 100%. It's going to be really, really cool. All right, we have weapons and armor. We need to use it. Let's go as fast as we can and try to destroy all these zombies. I want to do it as fast as possible and of course defeat them. It's not their train. Yeah, that's right. The faster we all do it, the better it will be for all of us. I want to get this over with as soon as possible. Anyway, just win and kick them out. Great, we've already beaten off one room. We can move on and destroy the others. The faster we do that, the faster we can get off the train and clear the obstacle. I really hope there won't be so many zombies in there. We need to make sure we have enough more ammo. Mikey, there aren't that many zombies left. We just need to take them out and destroy them. Shoot with everything you've got. That way we'll defeat them quickly and free our train. Yoo-hoo, we did it. We were able to defeat all of them and take back the train. It was really easy, but the further we go, the harder it will be. Good job, Mikey. Our goal was always going to be hard. 
That's why we can tackle any task together. I'm 100% sure of it. We're definitely not going to get ahead. We'll have to get off the train. Then we'll do it. Let's get out, Mikey. Good, we're finally out. Be careful, Mikey. There might be zombies in here. Yeah, I realize that. There really is a barricade here. It's really obstructing traffic. It's going to have to be 100% removed. There aren't all the rails here yet, either. We have to find somewhere to fix them. I really hope we can find and fix them very quickly. JJ, look, there are a lot of zombies out there. We need to destroy them as soon as possible. When we do, we can definitely rebuild those rails. Yeah, okay. Let's shoot at them as fast as we can. I want to finish this and forget about all the problems. We have to get to the end. There will definitely be survivors there. Just destroy the zombies and sooner or later you can make it to the end. Cover each other and fight together. That's the only way we can win. Yes, I really believe that we can handle all of this. It's only a problem of time. There are some buildings here. We should search them. There might be something there. I really want to go all the way to the end and win. Each of us is doing our best to push our train further. I want incredibly badly to get to the end to find out if there is someone there or not. We will definitely find out. Just not right now. You'll have to go along with it. There's going to be someone there 100%. I can't believe that all the people in the city have been wiped out by the virus. That's just impossible, JJ. We'll survive. All right, Mikey. We found the rails. That means we can rebuild the road and move on. We won't have any problems at all. We almost defeated all the zombies. Yeah. All we have to do is clear that rubble and we can figure something out about this. I want to solve all these problems as soon as possible and forget they exist. We have to send our train onward. That's our ultimate goal. The sooner we finish all this, the sooner we can solve all the problems. There's not much left to do, and we can really send our train onward. I want to get to the end and see what's even going on there. If there really is some sort of base there, that would be just incredibly cool. Anyway, we'll only be able to check it out this way. See it for ourselves. You're right, but I haven't found any information about a base. It's possible that this town is empty. If the city is empty, that would be very, very bad. But what can we do? I want to solve this as soon as possible and forget about it. I'm sure we can at least find something. We mustn't lose our spirit. Anyway, we've already come too far to give up halfway through. The further we go, the more opportunities we'll have. Great! We finally finished this road. We can drive on. Yes, we can really keep going. You and I are real fixers. So the further we go, the better it will be. I want to get this done as soon as possible. Great. Now, we can get back on the train. We still have a long way to go. Let's go inside! Great! Now we're farther along on the journey. We can get on the road. That was a really hard test we had to pass. We made it through and proved that we can keep driving to our goal. It was much easier than I thought it would be. So we will keep going further and further, no matter what. After all, our goal is really close at hand. JJ, oh no, there's a tree up ahead. We have to stop. Pull over, Mikey. Apparently, there are more obstacles to come. We've got to get out of the way. Yeah, you're right. This is a really big problem. There's a real burning tree. You can't remove it with your hands. We have to get water somewhere. We can't get it from our faucet because there won't be enough. I really hope there will be something useful for us in this part of town. We should try to find water, put out the fire and collect wood. JJ, look at this. There are really a lot of cakes here. This is my paradise. Mikey, that's really cool, but we can't take them away. We need some proper food. But these are cakes. That's the coolest thing here. Next, we'll go to the city itself. There's not much time left. The sooner we do all this, the better it will be. I hope so. Anyway, each of us will go to our own goal. It's very important. I believe that we will be able to go all the way to the end and find the survivors. There are 100% some villagers in this town. We will have to take them to our place. Our train is like a real fortress. No one can breach it. Not even the zombies and we can escape from any problem. We need to find water. Do you have a plan for how we'll get it at all? We can pour water down here and get it from a bucket. I've got an idea. Whoa, that's right. I didn't think of that at first. I love that idea. We should really organize, put out and remove this tree quickly. The most important thing now is to just get it over with and forget about the problems. Great, we've managed to find water and now we can pour it out. Our task will be done. I'm really glad it all worked out. It was really hard, but we did it. The whole problem is that each of us is doing things really well. I want to solve all the problems. Let's remove this tree and the path will be clear. There's quite a bit left already. Oh, we've gotten a lot of food. 
I'm sure everyone will need it. I believe that somewhere there is salvation from this zombie apocalypse. We'll end it very quickly and forget about it. I hope we solve it quickly. I'm sure each of us is making a mistake. Good, we got the fire out. Now we need to get this tree out. That will be a bigger problem. We have to try harder to do. Anyway, when we've done all this, we can restore our movement. There's not much left to do. I'm sure there won't be any further problems. I hope so too, because that would be too much. We are already in a very difficult situation. Good, it won't be long now and we can finally get it over with. We've replenished our food supply and now we're definitely in good shape. No one is going to get in our way. Yoo-hoo, we did it! We were able to clear the tree and pass another challenge. Now let's rebuild the road and we can go on our way. This is going to be really very cool. The road has been restored. Now we're on our way. Great, now we can hit the road. There's not much left to do. Yes, we can load up inside. It won't be a problem. We're finally back in our house. I want to go take a bath. This is a really big deal for us. We're gonna move on and on. I wanna get to the very end already and just forget about this apocalypse. Put all the food in the fridge for now. Then we'll think about where to go. JJ, there's a strange sound coming from the back of the wagon. We'll have to go see what that sound is because it could be a problem. Yeah, I was listening for something too. Could it be zombies getting in again? JJ, look, it's the villagers. One of them is completely infected. That's really very bad. They want us to let them inside. They know there's a safe place in town. We'll have to get them there. Do we agree? They could be very dangerous and attack us. We could defeat them safely, but we need to act carefully and only then trust them. Let them tell us where the base is. Okay, let's do it this way. You give us the information about the Survivor City and we'll keep you behind us. You can get there safely and they'll help you, but we won't have any contact. Fine, we now know where the Survivor Base is. That's very important to us. Now. We will keep our word and you will come with us. You won't be in any danger. You will be able to go all the way to the end and of course you will be safe. But we'll lock you up so you don't attack us. This will be your part. JJ, they agree and go back. We have to get them there as fast as possible. A little later we'll give them some food to make them feel better. I really hope the infected one can't infect the other one and we won't have a problem. They say there are a lot of military in that town. That will be our salvation. That's just great news. Our adventure has made sense now. This is really cool. That's why we need to hurry there as fast as possible because the military is there. They will definitely be able to fight off this city for a long time and we will help them with that because they'll always need our help. We are the universal soldiers. Yeah, you're right. It's too bad it's all come to this. This zombie apocalypse is terrible. The sooner we get it all done, the better it will be. I hope we have the strength and time to do it. Oh, Mikey, we're on our way. Just a little bit left and we're there. Woo, we're finally in town. This is our final stop. Now, our job is to find this base and try to negotiate to be accepted. We have a lot of resources and we can definitely help this village. So there won't be any problems for us. Let's stop, we finally arrived. We can disembark and look around. True, it's been a really long adventure. I'm just incredibly tired and want to rest as soon as possible because I just don't have the energy. I want to go watch cartoons and eat cookies. I know exactly what you mean, JJ. There's not much time left. These are really the last steps before we get to the living city. Mikey, look, there's really something built over there. There's a huge wall. That's probably the city with the military. We should be accepted 100%. If we're not accepted, it'll be really bad. Hey people, you're really alive. We finally found a town where we can be accepted. Will you accept us? Yes, this place is really a gathering place for all the non-infected. That means we can get through. Hey, don't throw away your weapons. We have to keep it on us because zombies might be around. Oh, right, okay. Now that we're allowed inside, we should look around. We can even take this car to the center of the city. That's where the most people are. It'll definitely be much more comfortable by car. I want to get there and find out more about this town. They have literally everything here. Houses, cars, guns, military. It's the most protected place against zombies and the zombie apocalypse. Let's move out. I'm behind the machine gun and ready to take down zombies wherever they are. Mikey, you definitely need to take it easy. There's only villagers here. That's really cool. JJ, look at this. There's a lot of people here. It's just an unbelievable amount of villagers. There's a new life here. We're safe. 
Phew, we finally made it here. We've come just an incredibly long way. We were able to organize a really serious journey and win it. Hey, there's a little zombie in here somewhere. It needs to be destroyed. Find him, Mikey. Take that. Accidentally hurt a villager? He'll definitely get some help here. Now this is our home. I want to live here and we'll live here. I want to build a TV so we can watch cartoons with you. This is really the best house we can get. So we'll live here now and then we'll see what happens. It even has a second floor. We'll definitely be able to make something fun here. This is our new life and we mustn't lose it with you, Mikey. We will protect and save all these villagers. We are on the same side. So the sooner we get this all done, the better it will be. I'm ready for the end already. We're going to line up our rooms here, make everything more good and explore the town. So friends, we'll see you very soon. Bye everybody.